Guys, you should see my dog with gems. I put them on her and go to the dog show. Yes, I glue the Why gems. Why do I not doubt that? <laughs> well, she looks like a princess when she <laughs> She loves it. And there's a dog mouth too, Judy. But a man with a beard, you couldn't do the mouth muzzle. It's a dog muzzle. This is probably going to be for a man with a beard. That's impractical. The mouth muzzle. Wolf, a wolf, and you get put the things for Halloween. You do the muzzle, the eye, and the fangs are written, drawn here. Judy, can I ask you a question? Sure. What, did you ever practice this on anything before you started out on basis? Well, I, uh, we had those kids that we brought over, and after I got my foot in fully up to here, I decided I better learn how to do this or figure out if I knew how. I got some kids and started painting. So I grabbed a bunch of kids. We had about six kids neighbor kids that came and sat on the back porch and we painted kids all afternoon and we painted them and then we washed them off and then we painted them some more and we figured out that yeah was, we had a big face painting convention in Largo Community Center and we painted each other's thighs all day oh yeah they all brought their palettes and was a face painting festival Everybody in the county got together and did the practice and videos. They watched videos together and practiced and compared their paints. Because that's a big thing to have the best paint in town, too. It's a competition. Well, you know, there's a lot of people that get into this and they're painting full body and they're doing a whole lot of stuff that the best to I don't I, I figure this is fun for yeah, me, just and if it's not fun anymore, I'm not going to do it. No. We have seen that where they take their clothes off. Oh, yes. There was a TV show. Full TV show about that. The Dunedin Parade always has a face painter. Well, I paint in Dunedin for Mardi Gras and yeah. for St. Patrick's yeah. and some other different. Parade my friend did two years, and last year I don't know who did. Somebody else they hired, and the yeah. tent, two face painters in the tent. And that even doesn't pay very well. They stuck with a menu. <laughs> Nobody deviated from the menu. Candy cane, Christmas tree, right here. There was only three or four things there in the menu. And the city paid them. And it was 2,000 kids. I think it was 150 bucks. When we did breakfast with Santa, my son and I did it. It was almost one of the first things we did. Uh -huh. How many came? How, how long? How many hours was that? Two hours. It was 70 kids. And how At much least. did you get paid? It was for tips. Oh, look! Count me out. I'll never do that no again. No way! I did my balloons. They tore the whole place in Margo up. I had the balloons all set up, and somebody drunk came and tore the whole thing out. When no, I sold balloons I'm for not tips. Doing that again. He wanted a $20 spider for his girlfriend and never made it out of the place. I also don't sit and spend hours painting uh, a turtle. No, I don't need that much detail. I paint freehand and I just... Spice him up with gar uh, glitter, I was going to say garlic, and then a trail. <laughs> a little trail of the, you know, a, a, the, the wave is cute. Just to fancy him up a little bit. The Hulk is very scary. I did the twist balloons, you know, and they'd stand in line and I'd give you the big spider. You had two round balloons and the three big legs on a stick, and you gave the tip in Largo. They had a big Halloween festival for years. In the 90s, I started the balloons. I taught the balloons. We had a face painter and puppets in the clown alley. Magic. You have to learn everything, but I don't do the face paint. But I know a lot of well, faces. Well, the other thing about this is you could sit and do this, but I, yeah. my, my uh, therapist said, no. He said, if you're going to do this, he said, you stand, stand up. with one foot in front of the other, and you rock yourself a little bit, and take a break every once in a while. And uh, I managed to do eight hours at St. Patrick's Day, but it just about killed me. And that was steady. That was no. A lot of people gave five for the spider when I did tips. Big, you get two bodies, 
two balloons for the body and three long ones is five dollars. It was good for one balloon. Well, mine are based on how long it takes to do them. Yeah, mine too, because a little one animal balloon, I can get the line out, the line down. The line gets long, and the parents start to fuss. Now I have to, I have solutions for that as well. Mary, my trays in there. I have uh, poker chips with numbers on them. Oh, and the parents hold oh, that. And they give everybody in line yeah, a poker yeah, chip, yeah. and I call numbers, and they yep. know I'm yep. loud. And, uh, yep. you, know. you could even put numbers on clothes pin and pin it to the child's shirt, and when they walk away from line, they're still number three. Because well, the parents have, fight for the line. They have a poker chip. That, yeah, that's, that's good. That Keep the line in order. This is cosmetology glue, okay? Oh. And what I'm going to do is just put a little... That's for the gym. That's for gems uh -huh. or glitter or that was Cosmo glue, so it's like for wigs and eyelashes. That's eyelash glue. Yeah. That's eyelash glue. Lovey has groomers glue. And I also have um, another little trick that I I haven't seen anybody that else do, so it must be mine. They have these for sewing, for putting the gems on sewing. It's a little sticky pointed. Oh, that's thing. a good idea. And you can go into your little box wherever you have and pick and up your up. little eye. And oh! And tack it on there. Oh, that's cute as can be. So, I'm going to get him a little He's got rolling eyes. He's oh, got the little Google, Google eyes. Glitter is everywhere when I'm done. Betty, she has your pictures in. Who's got the books? Look at that. Oh, my God. No, not yet. Alrighty. Let me get pictures. In the light, I have to see how the back light. So I'm 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 very happy to say that I also uh, sold watercolor paintings this summer. <laughs> so <laughs> I entered the Manitou Art Show, which is a show that has about a hundred entries in uh, Manitouish, Wisconsin, and it's in one of the premier shows in northern Wisconsin. So I entered two watercolors, and uh, when it came time for the takedown of the show, I called to see when I had to go and pick up my paintings. And the gal said, well, you don't have to come and pick them up. And I said, well, does that mean somebody's going to bring them to me? I lived about 40 miles away. No, she said, you sold both of them. I'm sending you a check. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And that's the first work I've actually sold from a show. So now that's I'm right. official. Yeah. <laughs> that's great. That's what, yeah. what sort of Can I see them here? Yeah. Judy? Yeah, he has a question. Yeah. What sort of glue do you use? Glue? Well, I have two kinds. I have a water-soluble cosmetology glitter glue. Okay. And I have, uh, it's really an eyelash glue. It's a cosmetic product that uh, you put eyelashes on with. Oh, look at those eyes. They're so cute. Oh. 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 Well, I was going to do Halloween stuff today, but I thought, you know. Thank you. Yeah. I hope you had fun. That was what I stayed for.